Hey there, health warriors. Did you know that the carnivore diet is not just about eating meat, but can also significantly improve your overall health? Quite surprising, isn't it? Our topic today, the carnivore diet, is not just a fad diet. It's a lifestyle change that can bring about a significant transformation in your health. The carnivore diet is a fascinating journey, and like most journeys, it's divided into stages. Five, to be precise. Each stage comes with its own unique challenges and rewards, and understanding these stages can make your journey smoother and more rewarding. But before we get started, I'd like to mention that 89% of the people watching this channel are not subscribed, and I'd really like to get that down to 60% or less. So, if you enjoy my content, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It really helps the channel grow. Now, let's delve into these stages one by one. Stage 1. The Decision The first step is always the hardest and that's particularly true for the carnivore diet. This journey begins with a decision, a mental commitment. Oftentimes, the toughest part is not the diet itself, but the decision to start. It's true, many feel trepidation, largely due to common misconceptions about meat and health. But overcoming these fears and deciding to make a change is pivotal. Now, once you've made that commitment, it's time to dive into the research. It's not about blindly plunging into a new dietary instead. It's about understanding the benefits and getting well informed before you embark on this journey. Knowing what to expect can make your transition smoother and more successful. So, arm yourself with knowledge about the carnivore diet. Understand its potential benefits, its challenges, and how it aligns with your personal health goals. Fun fact, did you know that the carnivore diet can help improve your sleep quality? Amazing, right? Knowledge is power when it comes to your health. Stage two, the adaptation. As you embark on this journey, your body will undergo some exciting changes. Welcome to the adaptation stage of the carnivore diet. This is where the real transformation begins. Imagine your body as a finely tuned machine that's been running on sugar for fuel. Now, you're asking it to switch gears and start burning fat instead. This transition phase is like a recalibration process, and it can be challenging. You might experience flu-like symptoms, often referred to as keto flu, as your body adjusts to its new fuel source. Fun fact, the keto flu is a common term in the carnivore diet community, referring to the initial discomfort as your body adjusts to burning fat for fuel. But fear not, these symptoms are temporary and a sign that your body is on the right track. Now let's talk about how to make this transition as smooth as possible. Think of it as a journey, and the first step is to ease into the diet. Starting with a ketogenic diet can be a less drastic shift and a helpful stepping stone towards the carnivore diet. It's like dipping your toes in the water before taking the plunge. Next, hydration is key. Drinking plenty of water helps flush out toxins and keep your body functioning optimally, but water alone isn't enough. As you cut out carbs, your body will also expel more electrolytes, those essential minerals that keep everything in balance. So, make sure to replenish your electrolytes to avoid feeling sluggish or dizzy. Finally, don't skimp on the fat. Fat is your new best friend. It's your body's new fuel, and you need to consume enough to keep your energy levels up. Remember, we're not just cutting out carbs here. We're replacing them with nutrient-dense, satiating fats. The adaptation stage might seem daunting, but with these tips in mind, you're well equipped to navigate this transition. Remember, every great journey begins with a single step, and you've already taken that step by choosing to embark on the carnivore diet. Yes, it might be tough, but the rewards are worth it. The road to health is not always easy, but it's a path well worth treading. So keep going, your body will thank you. Stage three, the health benefits realization now, this is where the magic happens. The carnivore diet isn't just about eating meat. It's about transforming your health. As you delve deeper into this diet, you'll start to realize tangible benefits to your well-being. One significant you'll notice is your energy levels. Gone are the days of sugar crashes and lethargy. You'll be bursting with vitality, and you might even forget when you last ate because your body will be efficiently utilizing the nutrients it gets from the food you consume. The carnivore diet isn't just a physical journey, it's also a mental one. Fun fact, many people on the carnivore diet report experiencing a mental clarity 
they've never had before. It's incredible how what we eat can impact our cognitive function. You might find yourself thinking more clearly, remembering things better, and feeling more focused and alert. It's like your brain has been given a fuel and is running on all cylinders. Inflammation, a common culprit behind various health issues, also significantly reduces when you're on the carnivore diet. You might notice that your joints no longer ache, your skin looks healthier, and chronic conditions start to improve. The diet acts like a natural anti-inflammatory, helping your body heal from within. And then there's autophagy, a process where your body cleans out damaged cells and regenerates new ones. It's like your body's personal housekeeping service, ensuring that everything is running smoothly efficiently. From improved energy levels to better cognitive function, reduced inflammation, and enhanced cell regeneration, the health benefits of the carnivore diet are truly transformational. Your body becomes a self-cleaning machine, and you'll love the results. Stage 4. Increased hunger. Don't be alarmed if you suddenly feel hungrier than usual. This is a common experience at stage 4 of the carnivore diet. As you start to shed body fat, your body begins to switch gears. Instead of primarily burning stored fat for energy, it starts to rely more heavily on the food you're eating. This switch may trigger increase in your appetite. Fun fact. Increased hunger is actually a sign that your body is efficiently burning fat for fuel. Might find yourself feeling ravenously hungry for a few weeks. But don't panic. This is just your body adjusting to its new fuel source. It's a natural part of the process and a sign that your body is becoming more efficient at using the nutrients you're giving it. During this period, it's important to listen to your body. If you're hungry, eat. Don't worry about counting calories or sticking to specific meal times. Your body is smart, it knows what it needs, and it will signal you when it's time to refuel. The carnivore diet isn't about restriction, it's about nourishing your body with high quality, nutrient dense foods. So, when hunger strikes, reach for a juicy steak or a hearty of bone broth. Just like the other stages of the carnivore diet, this increase in hunger is temporary. As your body continues to adjust, your appetite will eventually stabilize. So trust the process and remember, listen to your body. It knows what it needs. Stage 5. Maintenance mode. Congratulations, you've made it to the final stage. This is where the magic continues to happen. You've adapted, reaped the health benefits, and even weathered the storm of increased hunger. Now, you're in the maintenance mode of the carnivore diet, and it's about sustaining the lifestyle that you've worked so hard to achieve. In this stage, you've likely reached your goal weight and seen health improvements. It can be easy to think, I've made it, I can relax now. Maintenance is not about going back to old habits. It's about preserving the gains continuing to thrive. Sticking to the carnivore diet is key here. While some people might feel inclined to reintroduce low-carb foods, for many, staying carnivore is the best path. After all, why fix what isn't broken? The body has adapted to this way of living and it's thriving. Your energy levels remain high, you continue to gain muscle, and you feel a sense of overall well-being. Avoiding moderation is also important in this stage. It's easy to slip back into old habits under the guise of, you might think, one piece of bread won't hurt. It's not just about the physical effects, it's also about the mental commitment you've made to this lifestyle. A fun fact about this stage is that some people start to develop a heightened sense of taste. Foods that seemed bland before, like a simple steak, can become a universe of flavors. Here's another fun fact. The carnivore diet can help reduce food cravings and make feel more satisfied after meals. This is just one of the many ongoing benefits of sticking to the carnivore diet. The maintenance mode is not the end, it's a continuation. It's a commitment to living in a way that brings out the best in you and mentally. And remember, you're not alone in this. There's a whole community of carnivores out there sharing tips, support, and success stories. Stick with it and you'll continue to reap the benefits. This is your new norm, a lifestyle where you're in control, feeling great, and living life to the fullest. It's not just about the food you eat, but the life you lead. These are the five stages of the carnivore diet. We've journeyed from the initial decision, where making a mental commitment and doing your research are key. Then, 
we navigated the sometimes challenging transition phase of adaptation, offering tips to ease into this lifestyle shift. We then experienced the sweet spot of health benefits realization, where sugar cravings disappear, cognitive function improves, and our bodies start a beautiful process of self-cleaning. From there, we discussed the stage of increased hunger as our bodies adjust to a new fuel source, and finally, we outlined the importance of maintenance mode, where the focus is on sustaining the diet and reaping ongoing benefits. Each stage is a crucial part of the journey towards better health and wellness. Remember, your health is a journey, not a destination. Until next time, stay healthy, stay safe, and stay informed.